Hey there, this is Rachel Lubley, Senior Director with 31, and I wanted to show you how to um, make an issue account on um, the computer. So what this will do is it will give you um, online uh, monthly special flyers and catalog, like literally you can flip the pages, but online that you can give your customers and your hostesses. Now I've actually started giving them hostess packets this way too, in addition to the paper ones, especially for my online parties, because it's a quick, easy resource for them to just send someone a quick link of the customer special flyer, of the catalog, of the personalization sheet, of even the opportunity brochure. If you want quick, easy referrals, this has to be quick and easy. So I find that having an issue account makes that quick and easy. So I am going to go ahead and share my screen and I am going to go ahead and share with you how to make an issue account. So let's see. So here we are, we've got issue. Now what we wanna do is first you want to sign up. You're going to want to sign up and you're going to want to create a free issue account. Now there is no reason whatsoever to pay for an issue account. No reason. So don't pay for it. Now I'm just going to log in because I already have an account. Um, now you can upgrade to premium. Again, you don't want to do that. The basic plan is just fine. Um, the coolest part about this is that you actually can get followers. You can see I don't have very many. Um, and you can see how many people read it. So you can actually track this. So the first thing you want to do is go ahead to your profile right up here and you want to click on it. So we're gonna go right to public profile. And this is what people see when they go to your profile. So you're going to want to, yours is going to be blank. You're going to want to edit your profile. And when you click on here, and I'm not going to focus on this one today, you can do this, um, you can play, but you click on edit profile, you add a picture, you add, I like to have my town on there. Um, you can add a tiny little description and you can add your website because you want them to be able to click on your website. And then you can also add your Facebook account, your Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter, all of those things so that you are found easily on social media, which is exactly what you want. Now, these are publications that I already uploaded. Um, I uploaded all of these that are current for spring, summer 2018. Then I made this cool thing called a stack. Now I created a stack. This is where I do my, my February hostess packet. Um, my February hostesses get um, this little blurb. Thanks for partying with me in February. You can offer your friends and family the same awesome goodies. Oh, and I actually need to edit this. Good thing I'm reading it. The same awesome goodies in the January hostess section as long as it should ship to them. So see now I will change this also um, for my March one. My March hostesses will get a similar description saying they can shop from February as well. So how do you add stacks and what the heck am I even talking about? So up here on the top, there's this cute little upload button, right? You all have that, whether you have figured out your account and description and whatnot, but I wanted to give you a little run through. Select a file to get started. Now you will have already, um, and if you haven't already, go ahead and download the, um, the 31 catalog and the order form and all that stuff on there. Um, onto your computer because that way you can just pick so like here's the retirement list we just had the retirement list um, actually that one's really old um, no it's not what am I thinking fall 2017 so we just had um, a catalog changeover so I'm just gonna show you just for the heck of it I'll pick that one retirement list I'll choose it I already uploaded that onto my computer and we will upload it and then I'll show you what that looks like and I'll show you how to add it to a stack and how to create a stack. And this will take a minute. I picked this one instead of the catalog because it's much smaller than the catalog. It really shouldn't take too terribly long to upload. 
Now, while I'm doing this, I will just share with you that um, I've had big success with this. Um, I've tried other ways to do virtual hostess packets and it just is more complicated. It's not as easy to change. So here, it's already uploaded. Uh, we wanna change the name. So I like to do something like, get it before it's gone. Make it catchy. Description. These items are going away January 31st. Get them before they are gone. Then I'll put in the description, shop at my website. You wanna be really descriptive here because you want them to go to you or even call me at, and then I can put my name, my phone number. Doesn't matter the original, original publication day, allow download. You can allow the download, that's fine. Um, public, you wanna keep it public, and then public, publish now. So this is what they'll see, the get it before it's gone. None of this stuff up here matters. Just click continue. And then you can share it. If you're ready to share it, you can get the link and all that, but you don't need to do that right now. We just wanna to go to the publication list. And here is everything that I have uploaded. So you wanna just go ahead and download everything that you want from 31's website onto your computer in a file that says 31 so that you can easily find it. Then go ahead and upload all of them to issue to your free account and then after you upload all of them this is what it will look like you will see every document that you've uploaded right here and then what you want to do is add them to a stack so you want to do um, whatever month you're in you want to do a stack i also have one for joining my team so now get it before it's gone we can add this to a stack right here. Um, add to stack. Now I can pick why do what I do or February hostess or I can make a new stack. So let's go ahead and make a new one because that's what you guys are going to see. It's going to be blank. You're not going to see a stack. So stack title. Um, retirement. Get it before it's gone. And then you can do a big long description, but for, for time's sake, I'm just gonna copy it. Create stack. And now, add the stack. Get it before it's gone, has been added to the retirement list. Great. So now let's say you wanted to go ahead, let's go make sure, let's go to my public profile. Now you see all my publications again, including the new retirement list, and now you can see stacks. So now you see retirement, get it before it's gone. Now I am gonna just go a step further, and it's February, I already have my February stack, I already have my why do what I do stack, and I can actually go ahead and delete this one because obviously I don't need it right now. That was just to show you what to do. Now I wanna create a new stack. I wanna create my March one. So I'm just gonna copy my February. I'm gonna to go to public profile again and to my stacks and create a new stack. I'm gonna do March hostess. I'm gonna copy this all, because basically it's the same. Thanks for partying with me in March. You can offer your friends and family the same awesome goodies in the February hostess section as long as they choose the ship to them option and not ship it with the party. And these great offerings too. Hooray, thanks for being an awesome hostess. We are going to earn you so many goodies for free. Any questions, simply call or text me or email me. For your customers to shop directly, they can shop directly through me via phone or email or with you. Thanks to your hostess packet in your hands, which I, I mail them one as well, or even on the website at, and then my website and how to shop. Now I can create stack. Yay. 
So now I need to put some documents in my stack. So I'm going to go to my publication list, which is which is, I'm gonna play here for a minute, wrong place. Oh, here we go, it just brought me to it. I just clicked upload and closed it out and it brought me to my publication list. So I'm actually gonna go ahead and real quick delete my retirement list, because obviously I don't need that. And I want everything to go in my March hostess packet, except for the February hostess special. So I'm going to do the catalog, add to the stack. I'm going to do ever thought about doing what I do, of course. Add the stack. I'm going to do an order form, add the stack. I'm going to do personalization studio, add the stack. Then what I need is my March hostess special. So why don't we do that together? I am going to open up my 31today.com real quick. And I'll share my screen so you guys can see exactly from beginning to end how to do that. Okay, now I'm ready to share my screen with you. Again, share screen, here we go. So you know where to find the marketing materials. The easiest way is just to scroll to the bottom. We see marketing materials. You click March marketing materials. And this is basically where I download everything. You got the March customer special flyer, you want that. The personalization studio, you want that. You want, I guess that's basically it. You can do all these graphics if you want to, but you really don't need to do that there. So we want the March monthly special flyer. So I'm gonna click on it. It's gonna download. Here it is. I want to do file, export as PDF, March monthly special flyer, save. And now it's on my computer. So now let's go back to issue. If I can find it. I'm gonna share with you. Hopefully you can see this. You can see my issue account right here. So, I think you can see this okay. Now, we want to upgrade, we want to upload the March special flyer. March monthly special flyer. You see, it'll be a lot easier if you upload it to a 31 file. I probably should have done that. And uploading, 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 uploading. Do, 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 do. Okay. I'm gonna put half off purses. This is our March customer special. You get to choose any of these purses for half off for every 35 you spend. Simply shop on my website at shopwithrachel.com and click my parties and click shop now next to your hostess's name or look your very own party today. Okay. We can allow the download and publish. Shouldn't take very long. Continue. And then we want the publication list. And then once this is 
done, we'll add it to our March stack, then we will be all done and we will have March. Now you see how easy that was for me to add March because I already had everything uploaded from February and really it was from January. So I had, I started my issue account in January. So I had all the basics uploaded in January and then February and then now March. So all I'm gonna have to do every month, unless there's something new, like the spring um, gift guide is coming out in April or any other hot new news, all I have to do is upload that document and add it to that month and then it's easily shareable. So if the website is down or if something's really slow or whatever, I have all my documents in one place that I can share at the, at the drop of a hat. So here we go, half off purses, add a stack, March, add a stack, done. So I'll show you what this looks like, public profile. Now I've got all my documents right here, stacks, all good to go. And then I can do my March hostess and I can simply highlight up here, copy it, and then I am good to go. I just right click, copy, and then I can text it, Facebook message it, however I want. So I hope that was helpful for you all, and I hope that you learned something new, and um, I hope you try it, because really there's nothing to lose. Um, it's really easy to start your issue account, and it's just a really great, nice backup. So I hope you enjoyed that, um, and have an awesome night, and go ahead and create your issue account, and let me know how it goes. Thanks a lot. Rachel Lubley, Senior Director. Bye.